Good morning, everybody. So we do know that you all love to come along with us for our daily routine. So today we are actually going to go a little bit more in depth with our schooling of the girls, as well as we're going to get a little bit behind the scenes for our business. And today's video is actually sponsored by KiwiCo. And if you don't know what that is, do stay tuned because it is something that is very cool, especially for our little scientific minded children. Good morning, girls. Are you excited for today? Yeah. What day is it today? Monday. <laughs> Monday school day. Monday school. So what does, what does Monday mean? What are we doing today? Yeah, that's right. Are you excited for school? Last, yes. the last book of the year till you both graduate. Wow. You finished your school for the year. Yeah, and then we get summer break. Summer break. So exciting. All right, girls, what are we supposed to do first thing in the morning? Eat breakfast. And then? Um, do schoolwork. Woohoo! Let's run, let's run! Let's go, let's run! Let's go, run, go, let's run! Let's run, let's run! All right, girls, let's go. Okay, my little girl likes this spot. So if you're a parent, you'll know what it's like to have to catch up on household chores. We usually finish our breakfast and while William is getting them ready to go upstairs to start their homeschooling, I will generally just kind of start tidying up the kitchen and the living room and putting dishes away and vacuuming and mopping and all of those fun things that we absolutely love to do. Um, but honestly, if you don't keep up on your household chores, things get really cluttered and really messy really quick. So we always try to stay on top of it and make sure that everything is spick and span every single morning. Here you go, and today is Monday. So here's your Monday. Monday is gonna go today. I mean, yesterday was Sunday. Sunday. Izzy, what letter are you doing today? I don't know. What letter is this? Can you show Mama how you trace the O? O snake's tail. So then, do you think that that was fun? No. <laughs> and then that's out. Good that's, job, that's Amina. Amazing. You did such a great job reading. What what story is that? What's what's the storybook's name? It's a tough one. Tail. Yeah. Tail tail. This is their actual main school book. We're on day, watch out, day five. So you have reading, which is, and then obviously you have like the right letter recognition because this is just for not even junior, well it's technically junior kindergarten, but she's still a year away from junior kindergarten. Let's show everybody what we're doing here. So then we have, again, letter recognition, which, sequence of letters so they cut these out. She also has supplementary work as well like her drawing journal and writing journal. And she also has these cute little books for little readers. And then she also has her ABC book which is all about just kind of letter recognition. A, B, C, D, so on and so forth. And then this is pretty amazing. So you, you started this one when I think when you were three. She's learning about money and what uh, our currency is and how you add it up and how many of one to make another. So while William is doing schooling with the kids, I will go straight to the office and catch up on answering emails, business emails, and answering customer care questions, and just getting ca caught up with like all of the Lala Hijabs orders that have come in over the weekend, and printing labels, and shipping, and all that kind of stuff. So generally this will take me about an hour or two, and by that time, the girls will be finished school. We go down, we have a snack, and start gearing up for lunch time. All right, so at this point, the girls have finished their schooling. I have finished all of my business emails and we just finished having lunch. I didn't get a chance to record that because we were mad scrambling. <laughs> um, and now we are just about to sit down and the girls are going to open up their KiwiCo boxes. They're super excited. So let's go to the living room and you can see. So a huge thank you to KiwiCo for sponsoring today's video. If you haven't heard of them before, they are based in California. It was actually started by a mom of a three who really wanted to encourage engineering and teaching kids to create their own innovative designs 
um, and really become creative problem solvers and critical thinkers, which is something our kids love. Are you excited? Yes, I get to make my own campfire. Oh my goodness, you're gonna make your own campfire? Yes, and now here's Appy. Oh no. Is that when Appy is? Yes. Are you gonna roast some marshmallows over your campfire? Yes! <laughs> Whoa! You have a kiwi crate. A kiwi? A kiwi crate and a koala crate. Oh my goodness. Wow, so it comes with oh, everything that you that need in one that. box. What do you have? No need to run to the store or anything because everything is in one box, all your supplies. What are you gonna build? Uh, I don't know. <laughs> pinball machine. Pinball machine. These are the instructions it looks like. Oh, yeah, God. that's the instructions. Can that's I see what they look like? Pinball. Wow, so it shows you everything that's inside of your crate. Oh, yeah. We want and to this go. tells yeah. you what to do. What is Oh, wow. Okay, keep to make sure they don't come apart. This is the campfire. This is the campfire. Uh, Let's get started. What do you think? Yeah. yeah. Do you want to make your campfire first? So every single box will come in the mail to your door and each monthly crate is designed by experts and tested by little children and they come with these super cute instruction manuals so the kids really understand step by step what to do to create their project and it exposes kids to concepts in STEAM and if you don't know what that is, STEAM stands for Science, Technology, Engineering, Art and Math. Um, everything is so educational. It really is a hands-on experience for your kids to explore and really become super creative and understand how things work and how things kind of mold together and create new things. And it's just so great. And the cool thing is, you guys, is the boxes come by age. So Zainab's box is completely different than Amina's box. They are two years apart and so the projects that are coming in Zainab's box are going to be a lot more simple and a lot more easy to understand for her, whereas Amina's might be a little bit more intricate and more complex because she is older and understands things differently than Zainab does. Um, so I absolutely love that about them and something really cool you guys is that they now ship to more than 40 countries. It's such a great way to get kids to explore. And then this one is rubber bands, this is the pegs. The sticky foam, the washers, and the marble. So Why it literally best? splits everything up so that you can easily find everything. Look so at now Zainab's she needs beautiful fireplace. Did you it's not coming along? Okay. It's hard to tell because it, we'll wait till it's at nighttime. We'll film Maybe it a little bit more. Wait, what? That's pretty Maybe. awesome. Now what? Split it. Now like what? Now we gotta do, do s'mores. Do a close up of Amina you know, what she's doing, and then bend it. Okay. How do I? Then one the long one first, and then the short one. Hey, and you know what you're doing? You're basically riveting it together, just like Daddy does with airplanes. Wow. Put your other graham cracker on. You gotta make put your graham cracker on top to make your s'more. Yeah. All right. Okay, we'll set that aside. That's dessert. Here's your bun. So cool. Whoa! It looks like ice cream. Okay, roast your hot dog. Now put your ketchup and your mustard on. Got it, Amina. Fantastic. Daddy, look at me. Wow, sweetie. Okay, I'm going to do the same thing. Ketchup this. on there. Okay. Then you have some mustard. mustard on so there. Do the same thing. Put these in. Oh, thank you. Beautiful fireplace you made. Wait, but look at mine on the next piece. Look at Amina just going like crazy. Yeah, once she figured out how to do the, what are these called? These rods and it's the washers. Essen it's essentially riveting. Yeah. So once she figured that no. out, she's pretty quick now. And then on here, the and then on there. Where did you go? Okay. You even get to make it like a fox. Yeah. So what we're gonna do yeah. is get your oh my goodness! Both going to there. You're making your bear backpack. Yeah. Your camping backpack, hey? Yes. Wow. Mom, and is going wait. crazy over here with her pinball machine. And as parents, we have to really think about how brilliant our children are and how capable they are. We might think that things might be too complicated for them to understand, but you know, the things that they learn today are going to really impact how they change the world tomorrow. So KiwiCo really wants to inspire children so that, you know, they get to learn things today and then hopefully in the future they will be able to change the world 
and become these huge big thinkers and change makers and the amazing humans that we hope that they become one day. Amina and Zainab had an absolute blast creating their projects. They were so in line with what they're interested in and it was just so much fun. So if you want to try KiwiCo, you can get 50% off your first month off of any crate by just going to kiwico.com slash sallyfamily. Check it out in the description. Well done. Hey Milo. <laughs> <laughs> Mommy, I need wait, wait. Oh my goodness. Look at that cute little bear. Oh, should we ro should we make s'mores? You can use yes. Yeah. Okay. I got a special pen. I think Very I just. Yeah. Okay. Wait, All right. Can I show now? Yep. Yeah. Gotcha. Show mama. You can show them how you launch. Oh, look at that pinball, Amina and Zainab. You drew both you in there, hey? Yeah. Nice. Amina, did you enjoy building that? Yeah. Wasn't it awesome? Yeah. That was wow. my turn. I'll hold the board for you. So you're gonna, you're gonna aim, try to aim somewhere. You want, you want to get it in here. Oh, we gotta hit it a little harder. Yeah, just leave. Yeah, hit it hard. Pull it back. Whoa! Let it go. Oh, oh! So what we can do is we can stick. Yeah, yeah. So here is Zainab's finished campfire and she absolutely loved that bear backpack. She has not taken it off since she made it and that goes to show how much she loved this project. Um, I kind of need to like kind of sort everything out but alhamdulillah we are so grateful that uh, we run a business at home. While we're down here I have a whole bunch of orders to pack. And while I'm down here, or Will's down here, generally the girls will be here playing. We actually have like an entire setup um, right here. We have a jungle gym, we have a trampoline, we've got their bikes, we have a bouncy castle, we're a little extra. And so that's how we kind of end our day, you guys. I will finish packing orders and then William will generally grab the packages and head off to the post office. And around this time, the girls are getting a little bit antsy, so they get to burn off some steam um, here in the same space that I'm working at. So they will either climb on their jungle gym or jump on their trampoline, or actually I set up their bouncy castle, so they've been jumping like nonstop. Um, and because we've been in lockdown here in Ontario for a really long time now, uh, we had to really get creative in you know ways that they could burn off some energy so we ended up just creating this nice gym space for them to kind of explore and jump around and play and burn off their steam so we hope you guys enjoyed today's video if you did be sure to give it a thumbs up and leave us a comment down below and tell us what we should film next or if we should continue doing this day in the life series we hope you guys loved it thank you so much for being here and watching and have an amazing day